everybody, my name is Super Creepo Kid, and today I'm doing a different video. I know in Sky Realms, in this server called Sky Realms, it's really hard to get money. But today I'm going to show you how to get money. And also, I just want to show you up there what I made. This beautiful creation of the, 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 the Mario. Yeah, Mario. Ha <laughs> ha. Wait, wait, let's get started with this, shall we? Number one is mining. So, uh, as you guys know, AFK mining is banned, so just mine, okay? And don't be a cheater, stupid face. But anyway, so people mine, and then um, they put, and then they sell the cobblestone at spawn, but I want to show you something at spawn, what the difference between stone and cobblestone is. So you can make a lot more money. So right now, I'm at spawn, and look over here that I found. Wait, no, not over there. Over here, what I found, right over here is blocks. You can sell cobblestone for $164. But you can sell stone for $288. Yeah. So, you should turn your cobblestone into stone really easy. But a bunch of times this is really hard. Because you're probably like, oh no, I need a bunch of furnaces. Which you'll probably have if you finish tier 2 of the achievement book. So anyway... Let me go to my Skyrim and uh, show you how to easily smelt the um smelt the cobblestone with only one furnace. So right now I'm at my spawner. I mean <laughs> my furnace, and it has a stone smelting. Now notice when this smelts, what happens? I mean, there we go. Did you see that? It didn't change. The cobblestone number didn't change. Um, because all all you have to do is make a um a super furnace. This is what I like to call a super furnace. If you have like a lot of iron and a lot of wood and one furnace, okay. Uh, you can make uh, three chests with only three chests. Okay. So, this chest is for the items. And there's a lot of stuff waiting to be here. Smelt. To smelt. And they go down here and then go down here in this chest. So, you can, mul mul you can smell multiple items. And, yeah. You can smell multiple items. So here's the items and the coal. So you can, so it's, so now you're probably wondering if you need, if you want to smell a bunch of things that are different and stuff, you need coal and a lot of it. I mean, I have a lot of coal, but you don't need this much coal. You don't. But so this, so this feature allows you to smell as many items as you want non-stop. Yeah. So if you like collect an iron piece, you can just simply uh, smelt it in here and with, you, with your stone. And yeah, while you work and stuff, there it is. Okay, now I'm going to show you the next thing. Next best thing. Look at this. It's a cactus form. Why are these cactus forms so good? Well, because here are the cactuses. Pretty nice. And, oh, did you just see that? Did you see that? So, cactuses are strange. When they grow by a block, it disappears because they can't go by a block. Or they will just break automatically. So what geniuses have done in Minecraft to <laughs> to um fix this to fix this like cactus problem? 
was to make this thing called a aka cactus farm. So here's the sand and the so just follow this pattern. It's just uh, do whatever block you want at the bottom. Do sand, then the cactus, then like a fence or any type of block up here. And then it will grow and then it will disappear. It will punch off, fall in the water, go in one of these hoppers, and then fall in the chest. There's nothing in the chest because um, I kind of moved it downstairs. I thought it was nice. Right here. Yeah. So, last time, one minute ago, I had 56 cactus. Cacti. But now, I have 68 cactus. Cacti. Oh, I hate that word. Okay. But anyway, yeah. Now, I'm going to show you the next solution. Cocoa bean farms. Cocoa beans are so OP. What you can do with them is they can grow, and when you punch them, they spit out three cocoa beans. So it's really fast growing and really good. So, yeah. But you don't want to go around like just punching one by one um, coconut. So I'm going to show you what happens. So all you have to do is uh, set up this, I mean set up this right here, place a lever, two pistons, and then at the other side place a lever, two pistons, but there has to be a gap, you can see the reason, uh, you'll, you will see the reason why. So this is the reason why, so here's this cactus, if you push this lever, bam. Cactus is gone. I mean, <clears throat> coconut, coconuts gone. And there we go. And then, like, next day, the cat, the stuff grow, and then you can just push it again. Yeah. Cool, right? Yeah, I thought it was cool. It's pretty cool. Now, next thing. Beside the coconut thing. I didn't have to even cut the video out, but, mm, what? Okay, but anyway, so this is a this is a bunch of sugar cane right here, and yeah, that goes on the list. Sugar cane, sugar sugar cane is extremely um, it's really uh, the it sells for a lot. Yeah, it just sells for a lot and and. It grows pretty fast. They're like cactuses, but not cactuses. So you can't do that thing where there's fences and they can automatically grow. That would just be too OP. Because these are freaking expensive. And they sell for a lot. Yeah! So, how to plant these babies? So, uh, they grow better on sand. So, if you put sand down, and then sugar cane, you can do that. Oh, what's the... No, text is appearing in my screen. Text is appearing. Okay, well, that's better. Whoa. Okay, so, um, this is the... that. This is our, um... <coughs> This is a sugar cane farm. All you have to do is place grass or sand at the bottom. Do uh, yeah, do sugar cane on top with water because it can only grow by water. And yay, that's it. Now next thingy, trees. Trees are really easy to farm and heck of a lot expensive. They take a lot longer than normal plants to grow, but still, they're pretty good. So, you guys know how to plant trees. Just place a sapling. Okay, let me show you because it's so easy. So, get dirt. Place a sapling. Oh, let me do this. Okay. Get dirt. Place a sapling. Bam. It starts to grow. Okay. Now, next thing. 
a giant Mara statue. This baby can give you a lot of money. He, he just, um, so he punches question mark blocks and gets you coins. And those coins are a lot of money. So, yeah, you should get definitely build a Mario. Yeah, I'm joking. Okay, so here is a bunch of farms I have, but the most important here... I'll save that for later. <laughs> okay, but these... Just pretend these... Um, I, I don't have many... Yeah, I don't have many potatoes, but potatoes are the next thing. They are $30 each. $30, I mean, I wouldn't sell potato for that much. Man, I don't think I have potatoes planning, but potatoes are so OP, and you should get them. A good way to do this is do what I built, except not starey, just like... I don't know why I just did stairs. I was like, oh, let's do stairs. 